very windy, very tough bite today. But that murky chop you get from the wind when it's pushing into the bays, that seems to suck the bullheads in pretty solid. All right, so I'm doing a bit of worm fishing for panfish today. We got our first bite here. Doesn't feel very big, but it's a start. Really, really windy out, 20 mile an hour winds, unfortunately. What do we got here? A beautiful little bullhead to start us off. There we go. Finally got number two here. This guy wasn't that far out either. This murky chop is getting much more murky and often the bullhead and perch will move into this murky water here. A little bit better. That's a good eater. He is good. I don't want to poke myself. Hold on. Let me take my time grabbing him here. There he is, little beauty. Maybe not. No, that's a carp. Want me to grab that? Sure. All right, we got a carp on. He got a carp on, baby. I think it's a carp. Maybe not. Yeah, we got a... Well, it's not a very big carp. I don't know. I think so. Yep. I got it, I got it, I got it. There we go, a little carp. Little carp here, very cool. There we go. Another carp, I think. This time I got him on the eight pound test. Try and horse him in here. I'm not 100% sure this is a carp. Yeah, it's a carp. Never mind. I'm dumb. <laughs> Take it right in here. Beat some more carp. Oh yeah, she's a she's a fighter. Dude, this wind is outrageous. I'm trying to. Get her turned here. There she is. A little bigger carp. Cool. Very cool. Got her. This one's a little bit better. All right. Got another one here. This guy was just sitting on it. That's why you want to check your poles every 20 minutes or so. Sometimes they'll just eat the worm and sit there and not tug. This wind is turning into an on and off wind, which is kind of dope. What we got here? Nice bullhead. Cool. Very cool. Now we're talking. Now we're making rain, baby. Very nice. Is that on the right side? Yeah, this was the right side pole. Another small one, man. Usually they're so much bigger than they are today. Usually they're all 14 to 16, these bullheads. I mean, these little ones are eaters, but, oh, this is a better one. Didn't feel very heavy, but he's a good one. They're getting bigger, at least. Hallelujah. <laughs> Squiggly little guy, man. Very yellow. Cool. Hey, 
There he is. All right, so I moved over to a new spot because that, that other spot was just petering out. I spent, I probably took me three hours with no bites. It just completely petered out. So I figured I got like an hour left before it gets dark. I'm gonna go to a new spot. A beautiful bullhead on here. Cool. Number five, baby. Now we're talking. These bullhead today have been below average size for this lake. Kind of weird. All right, got another carp on. Hopefully he doesn't snag up with my other line there. I was just about to reel up the lines and quit for the day too. Yeah, he was caught in some junk for a minute there. Trying to, trying to do both rods at once. <laughs> there we go, got that one set up. Okay, now I can just fight this guy. Yeah, he's coming. He's swimming with me. See if we can see if we can beach him here. He's tugging really hard. Lol. Okay. This is carp number three for the day. Oh yeah, yeah. They sure do fight hard, man. You just take, I'm glad, I got him on the eight pound test rod at least. Yeah. I don't know, not much to say, man. Probably the last fish of the day. It's almost dark out. Yeah, def definitely last fish of the day, actually. I'm gonna pack it up after. Hopefully I can land this stupid thing. He was coming in for a minute there. Gotta tire him out. Will I get tired first or will he? That is the hot question. Got three of them the other day. One of them broke my hook of all the dumb things. I was using like a little skinny Aberdeen. This might be a bigger one. I have a feeling this is bigger than the other two today. Oh yeah. She's beefy. She is beefy. If I can just... Yep, yep, just like that. No, 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 no. You give up. Almost had her. Almost had her. Yep, 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 right. No, 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 no. Ah, there she goes. Definitely bigger. Definitely bigger. <coughs> got ya. I got her. <laughs> Another beautiful little carp. So I ended up with a humble stringer of bullhead this evening. So today I've been using two six foot six inch medium power fast action rods, Fluger Presidents, and six and eight pound mono. Also for rigging, I've been using three way slip sinker rigs with a worm on it. <laughs> 